If you're going for Shia, you really have to understand the nature of Shia. If you get hit, you lose. I, okay? So, either you hit them before they, they hit you, or the most important thing is don't get hit in Shia. That's the number one thing in Shia. Alright, so if you get hit, you lose, so you really have to understand uh, how not to get hit. I'm not saying block all the time. Okay? So that's why it's important for you to know about distance as well. If you if you if you're here, okay, let's say you're here, right? And he strikes men, my men, bam, like that. If I'm here, he get me. But if I'm here, he won't. So I only this movement, I can avoid to get hit. Okay, so that that that's very important for you guys to understand. So that's why I, I always emphasize on you have to learn distance. Only you only do this, and you can avoid to get hit. So even if you miss a little bit, right? But you have good ki, good posture, good timing. That right, man, from beginning to the end, that was good enough. That's how right, we free judges. Of course, it's important to strike, but it looked, you got it, and then you're convincing, and then you get it. That's why I always say when you practice as well, you gotta go, yeah! Yeah! That's how you should be practicing. If we don't have any shake in your normal thing, your cheese again, exactly. Kendo should be all the same. And we always say, you have to do kendo like your keiko, like you do shiai, you have to do shiai like you do keiko. Meaning, it doesn't have to be different. It has to be the same. Right. Okay, right. so uh, we're going to do men strike. Okay, so big or small, I don't care. Okay, but they have to be valid. Okay? Right. Right. So five times each, big, small, I don't care. All big, all small, too big. Pretty small, I don't care. Okay, but make sure they're bad. Hi, hi. If you're Montadachi, you have to make sure you are still trained. You have to know that. Go back. Oh, stop. You go, I have to be ready to. Right? And then if, you, if you miss, as my turn to spread, right? So if you miss, ha, okay. Shai and Jigeko as well, I do that all the time. Right? You miss and then I'm chase you. Right? So, you know, that kind of thing you have to always have in mind. So, when you're in Mongol Dachi, that's another way to learn distance. So, when he, let's say, he turned around, if I'm here, yeah, he turned, if I'm here, I can't, no way I can't. You know, he can't strike me, that's fine. I can't strike him either. So, when he turns, you have to look. Okay, he turns, I'm here, okay. Uh, I can't strike in that distance. So you have to position yourself better than you can. Right? So you're gonna have to start thinking about that kind of thing. Of course it's a drill. You have to man man and drill. And you, you have to you have to fix your form and all, you know, distance, yeah. This uh, by the way, distribution, you have to work on all that. But if you want to touch it, you have to make sure you are still trained. You have to know that. When you turn around, okay, if I'm here, I can strike. In the next video, was a training that works for Shiai? Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.